And it looks like we're going to get out of here a little bit early. I think you all really deserve extra credit for even coming to school at all on Friday evening. <laughs> um, would you like to say a couple things? And then I'll say something. Well, I was just wanted to thank you for everyone that was backing my program to um, to be here. And thank you very much for all of you, really. Thank you for a wonderful and excellent presentation. Apparently, all of you in your groups have made much effort and input and energy into your uh, organi organizing this presentation. And I, I would like also to take this opportunity to thank Professor Edwards for him to bring us this wonderful class and sharing with us his cross-country experiences and expertise. And uh, he's also a very generous man. If you are a course teacher, you know that. <laughs> and, um, I also like to say, in my opinion, cross-cultural experiences um, offers us the opportunity to re-examine ourselves and uh, to uh, not to for us to give up our previous experiences and opinions and uh, our prior self, but to foster a better self by connecting and uh, building um, some kind of trust and relationship with others and uh, a us to uh, just to be a better self and, and by accommodating different ideas and opinions and different ways of living. And this world is a globalized world. It's very, it's very small. Our planet is just more, nothing more than a dust in the universe. So, uh, in this uh, globalized village, I think that it's, there's many opportunities for us to even meet with each other, probably uh, three or five years later. Um, so it was quite a wonderful experience to study with all of you. and. Um, I also would like to say, um, um, wish all of you every success in your future career, and good luck. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm well aware of the fact that when I stop talking, you're free and the weekend begins, so I will make this very brief. First of all, I'd like to thank Junjun because you, you all realize that he came as a volunteer. He's come every week, sat here with us, and spent time with us, and done all the things that he has done for us as a volunteer. So when you have a chance, please thank him. And then for you, individually, I would like to say to all of you, this is not the end for you, it's really the beginning. I go back to the first introductions that you wrote for our journal, and I remember one that said, well, something, and I'm paraphrasing now, but something to the effect that, well, we really can't learn all of this in one class. And I said, yes, right. That's absolutely right. This is really just a beginning for you. And when I think about all of the different cultural environments that I have been in in all of my time and realize how much has changed in those years, I think about all of you younger people and where you are going and how dramatic the change is going to be. I just hope that you keep reinventing yourself, keep thinking about the problem, Keep trying to empathize with the people around you and trying to be flexible and uh, trying to understand. The last thing I'll say is this. This afternoon I went back to a recommendation that I had written for me in 1976. And it's just really history now for me. But take advantage, uh, I'm sure Jun Jun and I would be happy uh, to write after all, you did that midterm when you, when you wrote a self-introduction. But if any of you, for whatever reason that you're moving forward, need uh, either a paragraph or a sentence or something from Junjun or from me that you can put in your LinkedIn account or use some other way, please ask. Feel free. And then finally, some of you probably at the end of this period will disappear and leave Shanghai and may never come back. Some of you may stay here in Shanghai, but you have connected through this class. And there is a group on LinkedIn that you belong to. So reach out, as Jun Jun was saying, five years from now when you have a question. Go back to one of those classmates and say, hey, you remember me? <laughs> not too long ago, I had a classmate from Columbia University that I had not seen in 30 years call me up and say, hey, Michael, what you doing? And it turned out that she helped me do some business and I stayed with her in Los Angeles and she had just retired from a very successful career there and so on and so forth. So reach out to your classmates and take advantage of the tremendous resource that you have because as I said at the beginning of the class, it's not about me, it's not about a textbook, it's about you 
and what you can do with your life and take advantage of the opportunities that you have. Hope you have a good weekend and enjoy the rest of 2014. It's been my pleasure, truly. Thank you. Let's all go home or have a beer.